And there you go. That's it. That's a strike yes. rate. Be... Hey, how's it going? I'm good. How are you? For some, cosplay is a way to escape their everyday lives. For others, it may be a way to meet new people, create their own costumes, or even step into the shoes of their favorite characters. I'm here at Outback Leather where Kyle Wilhelm turned his cosplay into a career. Uh, I got started with cosplay uh, being a big fan of comics, anime, video games, and the costume design and wardrobe, the characters, like each costume representing the character's personality. Kyle met someone at the Maryland Renaissance Festival who worked next door to Outback Leather, a custom leather working shop in Laurel. She told him that the owner, Ron Sargent, was looking for an apprentice. So I was like, jumped right on that, came out, brought a bunch of my stuff. Um, like I, I dressed nice and everything and expecting just a regular job interview and instead, you know, asks the questions, goes, all right, good, put on the apron and get to work. From there, it seemed as if he had found his calling. Kyle now works full-time at Outback Leather and continues to cosplay on the side when he has time. Crafting has always been his passion since childhood, since he comes from a family of seamstresses, filmmakers, and stuntmen. He even had family who frequented Outback Leather. I had family that worked with Ron. Like, I had family that had been coming here for years, and no one told me. But yeah, it was just sheer luck. He enjoys making cosplays that the audience can understand, often making crossovers between popular series. He made a fusion between Assassin's Creed and Deadpool. He makes all of his armor builds out of leather. And once those costumes are finished, he enjoys wearing them to conventions and festivals with his friends. I love spending time with my friends and like the wacky adventures that happen at cons. Learning about different cosplays and learning how to make different things, like all my friends add a part in it, like um, Kyle, he's really good with leather. I have a couple friends that are good with like sewing and um, just coming up with stuff out of the, the blue. Oh, nothing that I fasten together, but people come fast together, so there's that. <laughs> um, as in this, this piece here is made by Kyle. It's a, it's a form of appreciation, something tangible, something to actually hold on to you and remind you. At Outback Leather, Kyle often works on repairing, cleaning, and restoring leather pieces of all kinds. They even create custom items. Kyle is creative and loves the work that he does. Leatherworking's not dead. And if you're in Laurel, uh, I know, I hear it all the time that, you know, people have lived here for countless years and have never, you know, realized that we are still here. We're still here. For Laurel TV, I'm Ilya Laughlin.